Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to create a binary converter in LabVIEW 2013. So go ahead and add a tank numeric indicator and five round LEDs. All of the following can be found in the link or I'll show you right now. Um, so to get the round LEDs you just right click and you say boolean round LED. For numeric indicator you go to round numeric and go to numeric indicator and for the tank you do the same thing but you go down to tank instead. So, right click control T. Um, what I want you to do here um, is not follow what I was doing and what I am going to do. So go ahead and just ignore the fact that I'm deleting these and what you want to do is you want to have everything here everything here is added automatically except for um, except for the a couple of things so first off these aren't added none of this right here that I just have inside this highlighted box is um, included yet to get these their expression is go to file numeric and you go to uh, expression node and for the addition you go to file numeric and add and then other than that you're going to need a couple other things you're going to need go to numeric and you're going to need to go to oh sorry boolean and you want a boolean 0 to 1 and you want 5 of those so I'm just going to copy and paste them from here alright alright now you're going to have to wire everything together and then now that that's all set put this to the positive or whatever you want to call it pin one and then um, connect this down here single to this and then this is going to come up here and then this is going to come here and then this alright connect this here and then simply connect this down here. That's it. That's all you need to create a binary converter in LabVIEW. Go ahead and run it and we'll see what happens. One would be one obviously. And then yeah, that's basically it. Honestly the but the LEDs are basically buttons. I don't like that part of this, but they have to go on somehow, so and simulation. Anyways, thank you for watching this tutorial on how to create a binary converter in LabVIEW 2013. Thank you. Bye.